All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our playthrough of Cyberpunk 2077. Living that street kid life. When we last left off, I was at the uh, the Ripper Dock down there, trying desperately to scrounge up the cash for Link's paws. I fell two thousand dollars short, even though I sold every bit of nourishment I had. All the food, all the drinks, gone. All the spare equipment, gone. All of my quick hack components, because we're not doing any hacking, sold them. As you can see, we ended up with 83000 And then I thought about it a little bit more, and I'm like, hey, for just over 100000 I can get the legendary Mantis plates. Go straight to the top. Although, I don't have the street cred for it. So I'm kind of caught in the middle. I don't know what to do. So I did nothing. I bought nothing. And we're just going to keep going. And get to this next mission. Jetero Shobo. Ring a bell? Guy's a fucking psychopath. Records himself torturing joy toys and sells that shit to like-minded scumbags. The mocks finally tracked him down. This is your chance to give this fucker what he deserves and earn a little scratch while you're at it. More on this sicko attached. Alright, we're gonna be fighting lots of enemies, guys. We'll see how well our build stands up. Access granted. guy didn't see us since we walked up to him in broad daylight, but I'm not questioning the stealth system. I'm just enjoying its benefits. like they know we're here. Uh, I can't get in there. Can I get you? Nothing for now. Anything? Nope. Anything that can bounce a signal off of?
There we go. All right, one C, 55, 55. Amy? Oh my gosh. Street cred. I probably need 50 street cred to equip the legendary man who plays. I didn't think about that until after I was halfway through talking about how I could get the money for him. So that ain't gonna work. I guess we'll just have to get the ones we can get. That doesn't mean we can't get the licks. Pause as well. All right, I want to say Be able to loot all these bottles? <laughs> Stairs are over there. For some reason, I thought they were somewhere else. Like over here. But this is just where we hack in all the machines. 1C. No, that won't work.
not as cool as when their heads get chopped off. I just want to make sure I didn't forget to loot something. We left the plug. <laughs> and then we had to go back in to loot the rest of the stuff. Alright, good times. Some of those kills allegedly made in stealth. I don't necessarily believe any of that, but whatever. We can jack into this machine real quick. Oh yeah, a lot of one C's. That's how you know you're getting paid. Hello everyone, 
I'm done now. Alright, go into Blades and get the last level of Roaring Waters. Alright, take a look ahead. Uh, I think we want Sting Like a Bee. Also, Blessed Blade. Oh my gosh. That's our next one. Alright, we have the massive street cred level of 20. You know, I hate to say it, the other Mantis Blades are so far off, I think, in terms of street cred. One less shithead in this city. Cream. Thanks, V. Closing the gate. All right, we are just going to get to Victor Vector. So if we're going to give money to any ripper in the city, we're going to give it to him. And we are going to get those Mantis Blades on, guys. And gals, I am very excited about this. It's the moment we have been waiting for in our playthrough. And then we are going to try to upgrade the Mantis Blades with the components as much as we can. Uh, we are going to skip the purple level Mantis Blades, I think, uh, due to cost. And go straight for the legendary ones. I know that means another probably 25 in street cred. Uh, I mean, we'll see. We're not really using a lot of weapons or whatever, so. Oh, yeah, we'll walk into the way of the car. Good grief. All right, so let's go get our Mantis Blades. Sorry about that, buddy. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. All right, so 88,000 credits to buy with. Okay. Love to put that in, but I can't. But what we can is put this on. Not a lot of money. Um, and I want to say just, I believe the street cred is going to be 35 and then 45 for the next one. So we will put on the Mantis Blades. Legs, we could buy this right now. We could go back to that Ripper Dock in Kabuki that would in theory sell it to us for 36. I'm still debating between this and the Lynx Paws. So that's where I'm at with that. All right, so let's see what else Mr. Vector has for us. Not really interested in that right now. I think we go back up to Kabuki to the big the big guy and get the top level legendary skin armor. That should help us out. Let's see what he has for trade, headshot, damage. We want that, and I know you're wondering why do we want that. Well, we want that because in the instances that we are going to have to shoot at someone, um, you know, obviously, we, uh, <laughs> if we have to use headshots and stuff, um, we want it to be as effective as we can. So we will use that. 
These other ones aren't very appealing to me. Alright. So let's go into our cyberware. And we've got crit chance increase, highlights enemies, explosive analysis. We don't really care about that. We're keeping that just to keep it. Uh, so we did get a boost there. And we'll go into our Mantis Blades. It comes with the physical damage. We have the physical damage. We're going to put the electrical ones on. And we will sell that bonus one back to Vin. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. Got any new toys? Have a look. Mm, let's see. We can sell all this stuff. And we'll sell that. Well, we don't need two cripple movements. All right, we don't need that. And we don't need anything with a down face on it. So we'll sell that, because the one we have is better. And we will sell this, because that one has crit chance associated. Alright. So, we're almost back to 70 grand already. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Another crit causing item. I want to say we have three of them right now. We've got this. Increases crit chance by 30%. I don't know how much these stack, so don't be yelling at the screen if I'm doing it wrong. That increases crit chance by 12. That increases crit chance by 12. I don't think you can go any more than that, so I don't plan to do any more than that. Um, stats. Crit chance 46. Presumably that is out of 100. All right, so let's take a look at the map, I guess. Um, I guess we could go do this. The evil me would like to keep going and try these Mantis Blades out in combat first. Uh, we'll do the side job while I think about that. Oh yeah, look at that. Amazing. Are they still looking for me? Don't even want to find you. I think they are. I mean, come on, folks. Get out of the way. You're just gonna sit there forever. All right, so we have to uh, get out of the area for a little bit. Go to this assault in progress. So even though we don't have a star, uh, it appears that they are looking for us. So, well, I guess walking right back over to where we were is a good idea. Ball turned on, I was like, we are out of there. All 
lights. Yep, I'm, I'm really debating in my head the Lynx Paws. We're only 15,000 away from affording those. Obviously, we can afford the double jump legs, which are very useful to get to hacking points and stuff, but we're really not doing a hacking build. So, stealth hitting these guys um, has been pretty cool. And I don't think I've ever used the Lynx Paws before, so I think I'm going to use them. What the fuck's going on in here? You know, and that is the animation that nobody liked because it takes so long. <laughs> and I mean, why? Why don't they just get rid of the animation? I don't need to lift everybody up in the air and throw them around. That's a big turnoff, and I just hope that with the legendary blades, um, that that animation does not exist. Because um, you can get lit up by groups of enemies if you're holding the guy up in the air for ten minutes. So that's not cool. All right. Not cool at all. Let's see if it is safe to go back. And watch the crazy guy talk about people spying on us through our eyes. without its body. What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of existence? I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live never cross that threshold, for their souls will join those ghostly ranks. You heard their voices? What did they say? They spoke not in the language of mortals, no. They howled, screaming in agony, forever removed from their earthly form. Among them was a woman her voice of ice, Queen Lilith. She was calm, but at the cost of her humanity. You ask, who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? No one's asking. And I answer you, the techno-necromancers of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Sure they do, Gary. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Oh, go wild, dude. All right. He will probably buy enough uh, glitter or whatever to get high all day long. All right, so I'm not very pleased about uh, the animation still existing with the Mantis arms. You know, I know that lots of people complained about it. You would think it would have been something they would have addressed. 
Nope. Nope, they didn't do that. So, I don't know. Right now I'm looking up the street cred required for the legendary Mantis Blades. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah. Yep, nobody updated their websites. They're all like, oh, yeah, you can just go find them out in the world. No, you really can't. Are you going to tell me how much they are? Scroll, scroll, scroll. Of course they don't. Great job. All right, so we're headed here. Let's see what we can find. And I don't want to subject you to me running down the street wildly like a madman. thinks about my great plan to uh hey v you want to do a good deed and make some eddies while you're at it you gotta get someone out of the tiger claws grip before they chop them into teeny tiny little pieces you in deeds attached don't make me ask twice it says don't raise the alarm yeah well that's probably not gonna happen I want to say if you are a sneaky type player over here, but if you are coordinated, allows you to get over the top. As you can see, the cost of all this stuff is going up a lot, um, of the breach protocols and stuff like that. And uh, we may not be able to ping anybody here. Yep, we don't have the RAM available to ping. So at this level right here, we're kind of being forced to choose if we're gonna have uh, more RAM or we're going to go with the Santa Vista or something like that. And I did not do my research beforehand. So I had to stop and look up the Manus Blades. I, didn't, I haven't done any research on the Berserk stuff, which I'm intending on using. So I have no idea how much it costs. That's telling me we're not going to be able to get in any other way other than the front door. Which is unfortunate because she's going to complain if we don't do a stealth rescue of this guy. We just don't have any other options because we, oh, don't have two body points available, do we? No. If we had body eight, we could have just ripped the door open. But we can't do that. Um, and I'm sorry, this is not going to be stealthy enough to be holding every kill up in the air to admire their dying body. So we're just going to have to go in strong. Okay. 
this is the way to be holding people up in the air stuff. Had to loot. It's not the same as run away. I intend to come back and kill you. All right, so I don't know what happened there, but the animation that I was bitching about disappeared, so I'm pretty happy about that. I mean, not that it's not cool the first time or whatever, but. You know, it's not necessary when you're being shot at by Come everybody out. to hold the Let's dude up in the like air. Warriors. Like that. So this is one of the um, jobs that a stealth playthrough, where you can deactivate all the cameras, when you can blind people, um, really goes a lot better. Or you can rip the door open, which I could not do from the outside. Tired to get you out of here. Can you walk? Man, I've got 43 fights under my belt. This isn't my first black and blue makeover. Say the word, and I'm right behind you. Okay, then get up. Time to turn tail. With you all the way. That's it. All right, I wanted to eat a Hawat dog real quick. And I want to say we were doing that. Blessed Blade, increase our crit chance by 20%. I can't help you. At least, not yeah, yeah, I know you can't help I'll me. I'll handle it. It's what I'm paid for. Real quick. Crit chance is now 46%. It was 46% before. So I don't know how that changed. It seems like it didn't change at all. Good grief, this guy takes forever. While we're waiting for him, we're just gonna shred these clothing items that we're never gonna wear. Oh, well, I would love to know what to say here. 
Are, um, are you going to go out the door? Or are you just going to stand here going through the wall? All right, so I think in this game, it goes without saying that um, a lot of these gangs, like the Tiger Claws, are the enforcement arm for Arasaka. Uh, Maelstrom is the enforcement arm for Militech. Um, I, I don't, I couldn't do that same kind of thing for every gang in the game. Um, but it's my belief, more often than not, that right. These, no need to thank me. Um, corporations also have a gang that works with them in order to further their aims. So it's just ironic to me. We're busting up the Tiger Claws. We work for Wakako, who's involved with the Tiger Claws. Um, you know, it's funny how it's all interwoven. It's like we're just fighting each other and stuff. Thanks. I, I think I can take it from here. I'm sure you will. Hey, listen. By the way, who threw down the eddies to bust me out? Masadu. He knew he'd be in a bit of a fix after the stunt he pulled. Huh. <laughs> Just like him to do that. First he lands me knee deep in shit, then tries to pull me out. Don't know if I should spit in his face or shake his hand when I see him now. It'd be better for both of you if you never saw each other again. Ever. You're on the level. Don't let this city swallow you up. And if it does, make sure it remembers you. All right. Regina's gonna call us and complain. Well, real secure, but I don't know. Guess I was expecting something more. Like, more discretion. Next time, try and go that extra mile, okay? Get closed. Next time, I will go to your house and kill you, lady. Um, gonna hit the side job up here. Jog there. Now, this will be a big test to see if our mantis blades. Hey, V, could you investigate something for me? Caught wind of a scuffle at the docks. Could be junkies, but this thing smells like a cyber psycho flare up to me. And I want to know if drugs played any part. A cold body's no good to check, so keep him alive. All right, so against my better judgment, we are going to go do two things here. We are going to go into cyberware. Uh, it said all your weapons are non lethal. We are going to swap it with that one. Uh, and hopefully that means our sword is non-lethal. I do not trust that the Mantis Blades uh, will be non-lethal. Um, so here, here goes. Actually, let's just be really safe and use this thing. We'll see how well this works, guys. I've never done this before. Uh, normally, I don't do non-lethal. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Funny, the cost of breaching a piece of equipment did not go up, but the cost of doing the hacks on a person went way up. All right, where is our cyber cycle? Oh, right Me. there. Well, 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 darling, where you off?
All right, I guess that worked. Except I can't jump up there. All right, he was hooked on some drug called glitter. All right, didn't burn through a ton of ammo there. Okay. Anything else here? La Perla de Alpes. Okay, let's message her. Okay, so that worked. Now I've just got to remember to go back into my cyberware and swap these back out. Let's go do this one. It's the closest. I think this is going to be another. I'll do anything for the boss. Of course. More. Another uh, oh, stealth yeah. one that we're not going to be able to do any stealth on, so. I'm sure Regina will be very happy about that. I'm just saying we don't have double jump legs, we don't, we do have a suppressor, but, hmm, we do have a suppressor. See, they have different um, crit chances versus reduction in base damage. And that's the difference in the two of those. playing cards. I an implant, I mean. Should be some easy breezy ads. You in? Catch the deets attached. Alright. Uh, let me reread that real quick. <clears throat> uh, once the implant back, how you get it back is your business, not mine. All right, so the big problem here is you got to make sure you don't attract the attention of the police. So... Okay. Normally there are some people over here. Uh, and if you have double jump legs, you could jump up there. So since we don't have double jump legs, we can't... Use that as a way to access anything. So we are just gonna, I mean, I, I hate to say it, we're just gonna have to walk in there and kill everybody. Um, we will go the back way.
love Mantis Blades, officer. I'm just sitting here minding my own business. These people, uh... They died of the whooping cough. Speaking of, dude, the best part is it's free now. Alright, so... Oh, my battery died. Hold on. At least it didn't die in the middle of combat. That would have been bad. Ripping the door open and getting the eye. Can't hack that. I am overweight here. Uh, Counterattacks with blades. I'm not really counterattacking. I'm just Ginsu knifing the crap out of people. Increases attack speed. Very, very tempting. Increased carrying capacity by 50. Also very tempting. Uh, cold blood, I think I will eventually get into you. Increases crit chance while sneaking. Well, let's be honest, they're pretty much dead the minute I touch them. And I'm sneaking. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's do that. Sting like a bee. Oh yeah, I've got a the thrash some inventory here. See, that's the other thing. Be cautious when you have a suppressor attached. Because it might make you think the um, rifle isn't as good as, it, as some of these other ones. I didn't really mean to trash that one. Um, but the suppressor is lower damage. So. Take the suppressor off. And you'll find sometimes your equipped item is still the best one. Alright, we got some choppy choppy stuff. You know, and another way to approach the Cyber Psycho thing, you know, there are some legendary bludgeon items in the game. You know, you could also carry one of those around and just equip it whenever you have to go non lethal, just a thought. So. Just want to make sure I didn't accidentally pick up something to destroy. Alright, let's take a look at the map. We've still got... Oh, we got to drop it off in the drop box. So let's go do that. And when we get to the drop box, we'll also... Okay. I have money! I don't like this. I, I really don't like that. You know, I guess the only way you can avoid that happening is moving away from the guy before the animation kicks in. 
That's so lame, CD Project Red. So lame. You need to fix that animation and get rid of it. Unless it is the last kill of the group of enemies. Or maybe a boss fight kill or something like that. Uber lame. I know they're watching this video right now and taking notes. That's why I said that stuff. Alright, here we are. Deposit the job item. Jacob got his eye back, so I'm closing this gig. But B, we both know that wasn't top quality work. Maybe try a little harder next time, okay? Gig closed, and thanks. Shut up, Regina. I don't... I'm not using the stealth build, so shut up. We do it my way. Alright, sell that, 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 that. Alright, go into here. And we're going to sell that one. Because the other one is better. All right, no duplicates there. And none there. Sell some junk. It's got almost 80 grand, about six grand away from the Link's Paws, which I've decided to go for, just because I've never had them before, never used it before. We are going to try to go down here. But that is going to be for our next video. Just checking the time. We're almost up on an hour. So I really appreciate you watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button and share it with someone else you think would like it. Comments always appreciated, read, and responded to, if appropriate. And subscribe for more Cyberpunk 2077, and of course, in the future, Far Cry 6, I promise. Thanks, see you in the next video.